Hello friends, I hope you enjoyed the 10 tips on the practical exams in medicine. So here, as my promise goes, here are 10 tips for your theory exams in medicine. So I have been checking papers and examining students for the good two decades now. Here are my 10 tips for writing a good theory exam and how to score well. Some of the areas that I will cover in this is mostly about presentation. Content I'm not going to talk about. So these tips can be used for any theory examination in any subject actually. But I'm making this for my medicine students appearing in undergraduate or postgraduate exams. So here are my 10 tips for a good theory paper. Tip number one, theory exam is as much a test of your presentation skills as it is a test of your knowledge. So make sure that you present well in your theory paper. Often people wonder how many colors should we use? What is the right number of colors? It's often seen that many students will write with so many colors that it becomes a rainbow. So here is my advice. Two colors are good, three colors are best, but anything more than three colors becomes a rainbow and difficult to check. It's always advisable that you start a new question on a new sheet and you label the question number and best to write the question heading prominently in a different color or highlight it in some way so that the examiner does not miss the question. Often what happens is the examiners are uh, short of time and they will skip a question because it was not visible. So make sure that your examiner in how much ever hurry he is, he should not miss a single question that you have answered. It might make a difference between passing and failing in exams if the examiner skips just one question or one page of your answer sheet. If you know the answer well, it's best to write in points and highlight the key points in some way so that the examiner looks and finds those key points and moves on. Often people wonder, how long should I write? Should it be half a page? Should it be one page? Should it be two pages? So although there is no appropriate answer to this question, yet my advice would be that for a short note type question, you should write at least two to three pages for every question in the medicine exam. So if you have about 10 short notes to write in three hours, you should be writing at least two to three pages for every question. Tip number six, preferably it is always better to follow the sequence of the question paper because when the examiner is checking your questions or your answer sheets, it's best if they find them in the sequential order that the questions were asked in the paper. If you want to change the sequence, it's okay. It's not uh, hard and fast, but it's preferable that you follow the sequence of questions. Your legibility is important. Even if your handwriting is bad, it should be at least legible and the examiner should be able to read what you have written. And it's good to be at least neat. Respect the lines on a ruled sheet. If you have a ruled paper on which you're writing, there are lines on that paper and follow the lines. Don't write away from the lines or don't disrespect the lines and leave appropriate margins on the right and the left. So that makes a good theory paper which is easy to correct and a pleasant uh, answer sheet and then then the examiner doesn't have a problem giving you marks and you don't miss out on any of the marks on questions that you have answered in your paper so those friends are my 10 tips for your exam to repeat theory exam is as much a test of your presentation as it is a test of your knowledge colors two are good three are best Start each question on a new sheet, label the question number, write in points, highlight the key points. Every question should generally not be less than two to three pages. Preferably follow the sequence of the question paper. Your legibility is important. If your handwriting is bad, at least be neat and respect the lines on the rule sheet and leave margins. Thank you. Thank you for watching and wish you all the best for your exams. May you do very well. And it may be a pleasure for any examiner to check your answer sheets and give you more marks. Thank you. All the best.